Yes, how are you, sir? I'm fine, sir. How are you, Papa? I'm good by the grace of God. Yes, I see it's better now. Your network is better. Can you tell us your name, where you are coming from, and the challenge that you want us to pray for? I can't hear you well. Can you can you try to speak louder? Hey, this brother, I'm sorry. This is my son here. Yes, can you try to speak louder? I can't hear you well. Yes, your name again? Oh, I can hear you now. Mercy, jo Mercy Joseph. Okay, where are you from? I am from Uganda, in eastern Uganda. Oh, eastern Uganda. Are you the one that said you are a pastor? Yes, yes, please, I am. Okay, do you have a church? Yes, I have a church. Okay, what is, what is it that is disturbing you that makes you feel that you need deliverance? Why do you say you need deliverance? I need deliverance on my little delay, a financial setback, and the patterns of sickness. I all see continuously, continuously, malaria, malaria, malaria. I finish treatment, I go to sickness. I finish treatment, I go to sickness again and again. Even right now, I'm undergoing treatment. It's just two days I fall sick, two days I fall sick. Hmm. So they say it's malaria. Yeah, they, they say it's malaria, but I'm not malaria because I get bad dreams that show me something is a problem. What kind of dreams are you talking about? Uh, sometimes I get dreams when there are uh, caterpillars entering through my mouth inside me. And then sometimes I get dreams like I am eating in the dream. <laughs> okay. I don't know the position where you are there. It's like you are outside. Can you can you try to go to the position where you can put your phone so that I can pray for you? Okay, okay. Now. Yes, Papa. Thank you, Jesus. Father, in your mercy, locate your child. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Lord, here is your servant in need of your healing power, your delivering power. In the name of Jesus Christ, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, any unclean spirit tormenting your life, tormenting your body, tormenting your ministry, I come against it right now in the name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, you sickness, you infirmity, I say, out in the name of Jesus Christ. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Let there be freedom. Let there be freedom in the name of Jesus Christ. Freedom in the name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. That torment, that torment from the enemy, I say, give way in the name of Jesus Christ. Give way in the name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord, for the grace. Thank you, Lord, for mercy. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I declare you free. I declare you healed. You are healed in the name of Jesus Christ. You are healed in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord, for grace. In Jesus' name, amen. You are blessed. Say, Jesus Christ has touched your case. I don't know how you were feeling because of this sickness, but how do you feel now after prayer? I feel changed. I feel very wonderful. I was shaking and I was trying to hold my hands and I saw the power of God moving me. Or oh, during prayer you were shaking? Yes. 
Yes, that is the power of God that was moving. But I'm saying the issue of sickness. I don't know. Were you feeling weak because you are saying you are also in treatment? This issue of malaria keeps on coming. How were you feeling before prayer? At least I am feeling better now. You are feeling better now. Jesus Christ has done it for you. You will come back with your testimony. Continue with the cross. Continue with the cross. That infirmity, it is cursed. That sickness, it is cursed in the name of Jesus Christ. You are free. Amen. Amen. Thank you so much, servant of God. I can't wait to hear your testimony. Amen. You are blessed. You are blessed. I have problems in the ministry. People come in, they want to give and help in the ministry. So I do evangelism. I will send you my photos for the ministry. You look at them. But when they want to give, they suddenly they, they disappear. Sometimes they give, but sometimes they don't. People to help in evangelizing. I go out very far places to evangelize in the bushes, in the villages, in the markets, in the centers. And then uh, lately I had a setback. Many people promised to help, but from nowhere it disappeared. Don't worry, don't worry, we have prayed. You know, though we are praying for healing, but the hand of God, the right hand of God is majestic to deliver, is majestic to bless. So don't worry, the blessing of God has come upon you. Jesus Christ has done it. You are blessed. Amen. Amen. Thank you, thank you, thank you.